We have more breaking news now. This from Britain, and they, it looks as though Britain has a new prime minister after Liz Truss resigned last week after just 44 days. But as CBS News' Ian Lee reports, the new leader has his work cut out for him. The UK is finally ready for Rishi. I am humbled and honored to have the support of my parliamentary colleagues and to be elected as leader of the Conservative and Unionist Party. Rishi Sunak now becomes Britain's youngest prime minister in more than a century. We now need stability and unity, and I will make it my utmost priority to bring our party and our country together. The 42-year-old previously lost the top spot to Liz Truss, but her disastrous 44 days in office saw the economy tank along with the British pound, inflation soar, and fears of recession grow. The party now hopes the Oxford and Stanford-educated Sunak has the right stuff. I pledge that I will serve you with integrity and humility. Sunak, a father of two, had a background in finance before entering government and becoming Boris Johnson's finance minister. Sunak enters office already making history. He becomes the first British prime minister of color and Indian heritage and also the first to follow the Hindu faith. Reigning on Sunak's victory is the country's opposition. The Labour Party argues the British people should pick the country's next leader. There is an alternative, and that's a stable Labour government. And the public are entitled to have their say, and that's why there should be a general election. But for now, it's up to Sunak to see if he can save the UK from financial disaster. Ian Lee, CBS News, London.